so it's Monday, July 4th. Um, man, it's so nice sleeping in here, I gotta tell you. I got the generator running now. Eric's on the computer having fun. I'm just gonna cook up some uh, lunch, slash breakfast, brunch, I guess is what they call it. <laughs> um, I got an appointment tomorrow in New Germany with a dentist. <laughs> Uh, I took out that tree that was offending the wire and cleaned up some trees that were blowing into the wire. Today's a beautiful day. There's a little bit of a breeze, so there's not many bugs around. Uh, I got a little bit of cleanup to do. But the trailer's looking really cool with the awning out. And uh, I got to clear out these trees, Get try that new chainsaw, see how good that is. But first, we're just gonna cook up some grub. Nummy num num. <laughs> oh, buddy. Oh, buddy, 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 buddy. It's, uh, Tuesday, July 5th. Uh, the tooth thing was getting a little crazy. So I buckled down and I went to a dentist. A rural dentist, a lovely doctor and assistant. They were awesome, so sweet. Anyway, part one of a root canal on the go. 1500 bucks, but yeah, small price to pay for keeping my tooth. I, I was going to say just yank the fricker right out, get rid of it. But uh, they were like, your teeth can cave in and stuff like that. So really, you should think about doing a root canal. I've always heard that root canals are extremely painful, but nothing compares to a tooth infection anyway. So I had part one done. They cleaned out, they scooped out all the nerves from my teeth. And they put some antibacterial stuff in there, and then uh, they put a temporary filling. My face is just now coming back. It's been frozen all morning. I couldn't eat or drink, and I had this itch, but then I, when I scratched, I couldn't feel the scratch, so it's very off-putting. Anyway, so I'm on the road to healthy living here. That's a good thing. Uh, what can I tell you? about this place. Um, I have done little amount of work because of the pain I've been in. Uh, probably uh, tried the new chainsaw shortly, but uh, Eric and I are going to go for a swim in the lake. Uh, pretty exciting. The neighbors invited us over to use their their launch and they have a little paddle boat and there's a raft with a water slide. Um, So I don't know if this tooth is aging me, but Eric and I went to Value Village and uh, the counter lady goes, by the way, it's Tuesday for Seniors Discount. <laughs> seniors Discount? Do I look 60? I look 60? Maybe I just look 60 because my face was frozen, I'd like to think. Anyway, so it's the first time I've been accused of being 60. So that's a milestone right there. Um, I guess I should have said, oh great, give me the seniors discount and then walked with a limp to the car and drove into something without signaling. But instead I was like, what? You think I'm 60? I'm 59 and a half. Anyway, um, the camp's looking good. It'd be great if I could get the pump fixed, but last night there was a mouse on the kitchen counter. I walked over, shined a light on him, he just looked at me with these big freaking spherical black eyes. He looked like a mini kangaroo. It's like, what the hell? I'm like, Tigger, Tigger, but I got my cat with me. It's like, Tigger, do your job, man. Kill the mouse. Anyway, so now I'm thinking that the rodents really did uh, eat the, the lines for the pump. So, I 
think I have to rip everything out. I don't know, man. Um, yesterday we went to my Uncle Duncan's in Mahone Bay and had a shower. So that was sweet. And we're going for a swim in the lake in about an hour. So that'll be cool. Anyway, not much to report except for the fact that I am no longer in pain. And I still have my tooth. Anyway, maybe I'll give you an update later if I do some cutting or something, something. But it's a gorgeous day out here. Like, gorgeous. It's like perfect. 26, a little bit of a breeze so there's no bugs. The homestead's coming along. Not. Anyway, that that for now. Yes, out, Zini, out. Oh, I forgot to mention, this weekend coming up, the Squid's got a big festival gig. I don't know if you're in town or you want to see the Squid's, but you should come on out to Upper Stewiak for the Poncha Collective Festival. I don't know what it's called. Anyway, if you're in town, come see the Squid's play. We got at least four out of five of the members, so that's going to be really exciting. So I got to drive into town. And for rehearsal and then drive out to the gig the next day. So we'll try to get a video diary of that, the fun times. All right, talk to you soon, Piaz. Oh my God, the stupidity continues. Oh my God. So uh, I thought I'd kickstart the fire a little bit by pouring a little accelerant on it. I have some old chainsaw gas from last year. I'm trying to empty the small container so I can use it to make an experiment to do an experiment see how long generator runs on a liter of fuel anyway I stupidly lit the accelerant with a lighter and there was a ball of flame that took all the hair off my arm and my leg oh it's smarts it's like third degree fourth degree burns so I cover myself in Vaseline I'm gonna freaking kill myself out here <sighs> you slow down be smart about stuff don't be an idiot and kill yourself rule number one maybe apparently my eyebrows <laughs> got toasted too that was uh, a scary ball of flame about 10 feet high Hey, Jesus. Week one. Day four. Been engulfed in a ball of flame. Got a root canal. Almost destroyed the trailer with maple tree. Got no eyebrows. Welcome to the woods. What about eyelashes? Do I have any of those? <laughs> Just when I'm starting to recover from my tooth, be able to get on with business, now I got burning sensation on my legs and arm. My leg and my arm. You can't hear me. <laughs> like if it's not one thing, it's something else. Like, just when I'm recovering from my tooth pain so I can get on with starting to do work around here, I set myself on fire. I'm a little too sore to go near the fire right now. I'm blistering up a little bit on my arm here. That was freaking serious. My right leg looks like I'm a bodybuilder. And how about these uh, pink back at the room eyebrows? Just in time for my gig next Sunday. I mean, fuck, if it doesn't rain, it pours. I don't know. I gotta just fight against the universe's momentum here. We gotta change the status quo if it don't kill us first. I lost lighter uh, from the ball of fire. I think I just dropped everything and ran. 
You like my new eyebrows? It's the uh, burnt swept look. If it wasn't for bad luck. Um, I'm going to test out the microwave. I'm going to power microwave the potatoes and instead of making a fire, uh, maybe we do the s'mores on the microwave because uh, I don't even want to go near that fire anymore right now. Unless I turn my left side to it, I'm okay. I don't know if you can see this, but my eyelashes are singed. My eyebrows, I'm lucky to have any hair right now. Every time I blink, my eyes stick together, my eyelids stick together because the ends of my eyebrow, my eyelashes are singed. And my eyebrows feel like Velcro. Oh man. I've never actually really, I've never owned a microwave before. Never really cooked with one. But uh, I don't really want to get next to the fire. So I've decided to par cook the potatoes in the microwave. That being said, we're gonna have a traditional log fire later on uh, to do s'mores. We're gonna do uh, the s'mores right, but right now I'm staying away from the, uh, the fire. All right, getting ready for a little stir fry here. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. That's gonna be good. If it wasn't for the giant excavator behind me going beep 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 and the generator going blah 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 blah. Basically we're living in the 1800s here. Right now since the water pump doesn't work we have no running water so it's a pain in the arse. You gotta wash your dishes, put them aside, dump the water, get fresh water, rinse your dishes, um, it's all the modern conveniences tweaked a little bit you know this is why in the old days they're like clean your plate young lad because it makes it easier for everybody else if you clean your plate off I mean nowadays you just chuck everything in the dishwasher pay for absorbent monthly fees and uh, so that you don't have to do anything but you can work you got more time to work for the man don't you so you know, maybe the 1800s wasn't so bad. Sure, you had to spend all day scrubbing your shirts in the river and filling up a water basin to wash your crotch. Wash your crotch. Filling up a water basin to wash your crotch. You know, but you had all that time during the day to do all that stuff because you didn't have to pay for all these services and conveniences and modern things that we are bred now to need and want and demand. This, this camp stove here is producing, uh, oh, this is gonna be so delicious. Um, I didn't do any work for the man today. I just, uh, we went for a swim in the lake. We're about to pig out. We got a perfect uh, little fire going here uh, for s'mores after dinner. Got the generator going, answering emails, editing video. Having fun out here. Except, there's no toilet, there's no running water, and the generator is loud when the electricity's gone. We got a few little uh, hoops to jump through here, and then hopefully we can come to the 20th century at least. I mean, we do have the computer and high speed internet, so, and that lovely excavator behind me. Listen, I want you guys to check out this video today that I made today, this one right now. So I'm not gonna film anymore today and I'm gonna get right to editing and post this right away. Uh, so you can see the ridiculousness of my eyebrows and eyelashes. Uh, it's been a pretty funny episode. My tooth is doing a lot better. All right, I'll talk to you soon in episode nine. Stay tuned, will I still be alive? almost forgot to end it off with the s'mores, s'mores, but uh, every time I blink it's like I got Velcro.
from my burnt eyelashes. Oh yeah, conduct an experiment with generator, put five liters in there, see how long it runs on five liters. That's why it's irritatingly on in the background light right now. Let's have a look, present it. Oh, that's looking real good. <laughs> 